We have certainly reported about the victims of muggings, but what about juggings? That's a new crime trend, targeting victims for their money. CBS 2's Hermila Aragawi has details on this trend and how police busted two suspects. These are the faces of jugging, a play on mugging. Police say it's a growing crime that targets customers who have just left a bank or ATM with cash. Most incidents occur on non-bank property, typically outside retail or commercial businesses. Investigators say on Friday they arrested Davian Lockhart and Christopher Curry of Texas, who they believe are responsible for dozens of jugging burglaries across Southern California. Detectives watched the two men as they followed this Rolls Royce from a Bank of America on Ventura Boulevard in Encino to a health center in Sherman Oaks. After the vehicle was parked and unoccupied, the suspect smashed the front passenger window and pried the door of the Rolls Royce to gain entry. Police say investigators followed the two men and arrested them without incident. When they searched their vehicle, they found $21,000 in cash, and they say much of that was from the Rolls Royce. All too often, customers leave the envelope in the car with large sums of cash in it. But investigators say Lockhart and Curry are just two of up to 100 people that are flying into Southern California to do this. Here's security video of a separate jugging burglary in Thousand Oaks last month. Police say the criminals stay in hotels, rent cars, then drive around following bank customers to different locations where they break into their cars and take off with their money. Investigators say they've been working with police in Houston and have figured out that a lot of these suspects are based in Texas. And they say they've been working together to target about 17 states. Reporting from LAPD headquarters, I'm Hermel Aragawi, CBS 2 News.